have it to me. How was your tea, Fred? Pretty good. Well, yeah. What do you mean, Well, you know. Go on. Can I have a cabbage? Good alumi, Gar. That's a chef. Well done, chef. <laughs> Feel it, do they? Ready? Ready, go? That's really good. Ready? Alice, Alice, I didn't, I didn't get it done, darling. I didn't get it done. Well done. One, two, three, open them. Who done that? Hold on, take moments. Ha, 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 ha. 
Yeah, you can probably growl at us a little bit. Don't really burp. Oh, it's him drinking. And they'll bank around, they'll fan those tails out to use as they're braking and they're steering. Who's going to land first today? Or they're going to have to do another run up. If we can't come back from that number of loss, one of these birds takes six years to mature. It then has to find a mate, it then has to try and successfully breed, and they only have a maximum of one chick per year. So you cannot call that amount of numbers back ever. So we need to do everything we can to conserve these birds and look after them because we cannot afford to lose them out of our ecosystem. Now, before they go away, we are very, very lucky because as you'll see, we have another Avery with some vultures in as well. See what I mean? You can just pick him up. He's just like a Labrador, really. <laughs> And this is why he's called Scruff, because he has no balance. But over in this aviary here, you'll see we have various pairs of birds. Now, that's because they're our breeding pairs. And thankfully, where is he? He's sat here at the... Three, four, five, six. Ooh. Seven. So they've got Coco coming in first and then Peanuts has the top of dog. He has to land between Coco and Rachel. <laughs> I hope you two have enjoyed them. They've done a fantastic job out here today. So let's hear it for Peanuts and Coco. Our two blue and yellow before. You're in the hot seat there, I'm afraid, for them. <laughs> I like the light one.